to live life at your optimum levels and to really feel your best, I believe you have to fast two days out the week, 48 hours out the week. You should have no food. We go to the gym, we train our muscles, we train, we train our, uh, to get a six pack, you know, we train our minds to get good grades in school. We train everything, but one thing we, most of us don't train enough is the hunger muscle. <clears throat> if you look in nature, everything in nature is hungry. Everything in nature is fighting for survival. We fight for survival as well, but a big part of the human experience or anything that's alive is the feeling of hunger. And the feeling of hunger gives a lot of benefits. <clears throat> the reason I say 48 hours of no food and five days of food is because it takes 48 hours to hit the state of autophagy is like, is a state where your body clears out all of the old cells and damaged cells, damaged proteins, damaged things in your body, and kind of just restores it and kind of regenerates it. <clears throat> it's like taking out the trash, basically, for your body. You know, um, if you have a house and you keep piling trash on it and piling trash and piling trash, and you only take out some trash here and there, it just really doesn't make sense. You know, you're not gonna be living comfortably. And that's basically what a lot of people are doing with uh, their bodies, you know, <clears throat> eating five times, eating uh, three times a day, eating every day out of the week. You know, probably most people eat more than three times a day, you know, because of snacks and stuff like that. So you're just piling trash on your body. The most important thing you have in this world, you know, um, and you only get one piling trash on it, piling trash on it, you know, but we take care of the trash in our house. So basically this state of autophagy is the, the 48 hour fast is the moment where you're taking out the trash in your body. You're taking out the, just the damaged stuff. So you're gonna, you're gonna be kind of refreshed, you know, and it makes all your organs work better <clears throat> and run better. You know, it's like getting an oil change for your car. So if you look at a whole lifespan, if you were doing this five days on, two days off, how much it would probably extend your life, you know? Um, if considering like, how, I think it would extend most people's lives significantly. And I think it would impact the quality of life much better as well. You know, everything in life is about balance, you know, but I think most of us don't really balance our diets or we have moments of balancing it. But I think it's a big thing where if you're taking care of your body, you're in the gym working out, building your muscles, you should also build the hunger muscle to be able to live your very best <clears throat> uh, physically and spiritually, you know being just disciplined and being like, I'm not going to eat for two days. Boom. No food, two days, just water, you know, and the rest of the time you're living a healthy lifestyle. You're eating healthy. You're not overeating. Yeah. You might have some ice cream here and there. You might have this here and there, but overall you're being healthy. And then two days out of the week, no food, your body repairs itself. It takes out the trash that you've piled on over the week throughout the month. I feel like after a year or two of that, your body would be so much younger than if you're eating every day constantly. This process of overeating, constantly eating, and not giving the body time to heal and uh, throw away the trash that has been built up in it is aging us. You know, it's definitely aging us. And that's why, you know, you see some people, they might be the same age, like this guy's 40 and that guy's 40. One guy looks like he's 60. The other guy looks like he's 40. He looks younger. He looks fresh. Why is that? You know? Yeah, some of it might be genetics, but I believe it's diet, uh, how often you eat, you know, the feeling of hunger. The times I felt best in my life was when I was hungry, you know? And, like, uh, I fasted every day, you know? I'd, I'd wake up, uh, no food, go train for a few hours, 
then I have my first meal, right? Then train the rest of the day, have a meal in the, at the night, like 6 p.m., and then no food, wake up the next day, train. That's how I felt my best. And then, and then I'd fast uh, sometimes three, time, three days out a week to hit the state of ketosis. But when I was fasting regularly, I felt way, way better, you know, way better. And um, I did a little biological test on myself to see, uh, you know, what my what my biological age was. And it was five years younger than I actually am. And I think a big part of that is because of the fasting that I did over the years. So I'm about to go back to that. <clears throat> and I just wanted to share that with you guys. I think uh, it will really give big, big benefits in your life and you know, it's just two days out of the week, you know, you get to eat every other day Two, what's two days going to do, you know, it's just going to make you stronger and more disciplined.